What is this? Yeah. You see this? Yeah. Looks like an old what is broken that? down building or oh, what something. What the hell? Where'd you where'd you find that? Strawberry Squad, what the hell is going on, guys? Hope you guys are all having a fantastic freaking day, guys. I am so tired right now. We literally just drove eight hours, guys, from Toronto to New Jersey, and you guys probably already can imagine. Actually, no, you you already know based on the title where we are right now. We are right now parked outside of the famous Clinton Road. I'm not alone, guys. I'm here with my boy Cameron Marshall. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I had to switch it up because you know you always tell me yo I do different shit. That was a crazy one, guys. Stay tuned if you want to see what he does in the next video. <laughs> yeah, gang, gang. We also got my boy Mark. <laughs> How was that? That was freaking dope, man. <laughs> but yo, guys, you can probably see that it's daytime right now, and that's because I'm way too chicken to come here at night. I actually already did it about two times on my channel, and I told myself that I would never do it again, guys. Along with that, you guys know we're in the car. That means we're gonna be doing a drone video, and the drones need light to be able to see. So it kind of gives me the excuse to not look like a little and come here during the day and yo guys just as proof that we actually are at the real clinton road check out that sign right there it's the the top one it literally says clinton road and yo if that was not enough proof for you guys check it out we are currently right here you can see it says clinton road and if i zoom out like you guys can actually check this out for yourself on google to make sure that i'm actually at the right location here's new jersey and i'm at the very top of new jersey guys exactly where clinton road is there's the full map so you can see like guys i actually cannot lie to you right now like i'm not the real thing. If you guys aren't familiar with Clinton Road, basically it is the most haunted road in not only North America, but the world. It actually breaks one of the world records for the longest stretch of road with zero lights on like, it. Like guys, and they're not freaking kidding. Like coming here at nighttime was a complete disaster. Like if something happens to your car while you're midway through this road, let me find the simplest way to put this. You're fucked. And not only that guys, but there has been countless, literally hundreds of deaths on this road related to car accidents because the road is so bendy and windy it's super easy to crash but the one aspect about this road that has always made it super dangerous throughout history is the middle point guys because the middle point is a part of the road that the locals around this town like to call dead man's curve i mean the name is self-explanatory guys dead man's curve it's an extremely sharp bend in the road like more than a 90 degree angle and there's literally no warning signs of this bend so a lot of people will go super fast down this road and then not have enough time to stop sending them straight into the ditch guys and most oftenly they end up dying i'm super glad that we don't have to get out of the car for this one we're just gonna stay in the whip and we're gonna let the drone do the dirty work but to start things off we are going to drive down the road all the way to the middle point otherwise known as dead man's curve you guys ready for this hell yeah bro let's do it fam i'm excited yo you're just saying that for the camera you're scared nah bro i came here with you before fam that that's... was nighttime it's daytime this is soft bro what yeah you talking that's about? true that's true but yo do you think we we're gonna be able to see something on the freaking drone i don't know because yo Clinton when i came road. bro when we came here at nighttime i never knew there was a big lake there and shit so i've already seen new things in daytime so well we're probably gonna see some yeah, crazy that's shit true, with the that's drone. true yo you ready for this yo but dead man's curve it kind of sounds like dead man's chest like the pirates of the caribbean movie so yeah. like are we gonna see pirates like the last video too i mean i don't know about that movie man mark but i have a feeling we're gonna see something crazy i mean we literally always do like how do we no seriously no pause for a sec no like guys how do we actually always see something crazy like it actually it. makes us look fake it I makes know. us look like we're like faking the videos i know i actually hate it fam i hate <laughs> i actually hate being with you. like i actually you. want i don't want a banger video this time like i actually want to find nothing that way they just they they know we're not faking it you know what I mean? Is that too uh, much to ask? Uh, like, for once, can we just go to a haunted place and have a peaceful journey? Exactly. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. All right, yo, if you guys are ready for this, make sure you drop a freaking like on this video. Hit that damn subscribe button. This is about to be a banger. I mean, I hope it's not, but I'm sure it's about to be. <laughs> and shout out to Cameron and Mark for joining me on this journey, guys. All of our social medias, including Instagram, will be down below in the description. And yeah, let's freaking... Uh, get this show on the road literally let's okay. do it man let's literally. do it man yo just to give you guys a better view of the sign there it is right there clinton road Ooh, guys you know we're on clinton road when you start seeing tombstones i was actually messed up yo, when you see that that's when you know it's about to get real another one guys another one we've already seen like five of those and we've been on the road for about three minutes like look at how creepy these woods are guys look at this what the hell there's literally shoes hanging off of the freaking wires here how creepy is that but yo what the hell dude somebody actually lives here yo, out of all the roads I... they could pick why why did they pick clinton road 
Like, do they like Hillary Clinton? <laughs> we are getting deeper, and the road is getting windier. Um, Guys, taking this road actually goes literally like another 50 miles. Like we've been on it for about five minutes now and we're nowhere close to the end. And yo guys, like literally check out these freaking creepy pathways that branch off of the Clinton Road. There's a whole bunch of these pathways, guys. They look super sketchy. Like, did you see that gate? Imagine exploring the pathways off of Clinton Road. Um, we should do it, to be honest. With the drone though. I'm not trying to walk, like I'm not trying That's to That's true, we could do it with the drone. Yeah. What the hell? Guys, somebody's literally jogging like deep into Clinton Road. Yo, they probably what the hell? Yo, there's literally like... nothing this way. Why are they why are they doing that? This is insane. Guys, we made it to freaking Dead Man's Curve. Check it out. Actually, it's nothing really too special, but this is it right here, guys. Like literally people would come racing down this road right up here and they would lose control and spiral out like all in this area. Right over there is the Dead Man's Curve bridge, guys. And basically, guys, the myth is that if you come to this bridge at 3 a.m. and throw a coin off of it, a little boy who actually died at this specific location, his spirit will come out and throw the coin back at you guys. We have got to test this out for ourselves maybe if we come back at night let me know if you guys want to see that video but for now we're gonna get this drone up in the air are you guys ready for this hell no i am you ready for this guys check out all these no trespassing signs like there's literally one on every single freaking tree and not only in this spot but along the entire road kind of gets you thinking like why are they preventing people from going into this forest? Like, what is it about this forest that they are so scared of people going inside? That's what I'm like, saying. Like, they want to keep people out. And when they're keeping people out, there's a reason on as to why, guys. They wouldn't just randomly not let people go in. Like, it's a freaking forest. Like, how bad could it be? Yeah, and they're literally, the signs are all down the road. Like, I know. from top to bottom, and there's the yellow ones and the red ones. What the red ones say? Like, they actually put in a lot of work, guys, to make sure that people are not freaking trespassing into this forest. And I have a feeling it has something to do with the fact that it's the forest off of Clinton Road. So when we get that drone up in the air, I'm going to need you guys to go down below and comment timestamps if you guys notice anything weird. All right, you guys, we are just about ready to get the drone up in the air. I just turned the controller on. All we got to do now is sink it. But yo, there are so many freaking trees around here, guys. So I'm thinking we're going to have to keep the drone pretty high for this one. And who knows with all these no trespassing signs, like guys, look, it even says property patrol. The guys who are patrolling this road, if they see the drone, they could freaking shoot it down. Like we're not in Canada anymore, guys. This is America. Don't they all have guns in America? I think so there, buddy. All right, we launching. God. All right, you guys, we now have this thing up in the air on Clinton Road, guys. This is absolutely insane. Bro. Probably the craziest drone video we are going to do yet. Do you think we're going to see something, man? I don't know, bro. I'm I still... hope so, fam. Guys, I should have the live feed up for you on the screen now. So like I always say, oh, if you yeah. notice anything, make sure to comment the timestamp down below and let us know. Because again, we're watching it on a small screen, guys. Small. Yeah, I know. But still, hopefully we're going to find that pirate, right? <laughs> I don't think we're gonna find a pirate here, but guys make sure you keep your eyes peeled Because what we want to do is we want to be looking through the forest line like through Whoa. the trees What wow, that was weird what dude happened? look how freaking long the road is. I know it's a mess. That is huge So like, you guys can see us right so there. Many? It's like shaped like a seven isn't seven like a Damn, this controversial is number I don't know. That is true. But it's this a weird is theory. all dead trees yeah. and just one good tree in the yeah, middle. Yeah, so right now, okay, right now, guys, we have the drone over the spot where it says no trespassing. So we can actually access parts that you're not normally allowed and we can see what's in them. So like, yeah, dude, I say- Make sure you don't hit a tree because yeah. there's like a lake right next to it too. Yeah, yeah dude, I say you, uh, I say you just take the, the drone like all over this forest area and just point it down and let's see if we can see anything. Because yeah. they're definitely trying to protect something, right? right they like have they have to be. to be. Yeah, and, yeah, no doubt. Like right now, I bet you that there's so much hidden that we don't even know about. Yeah, and the like closer the... we go, the harder it's going to be to not hit a tree, but we're going to do our best. Yeah, guys, we're going to try to get as close as possible, but this we want to make sure we prioritize the drone. Because if we by... lose the drone, guys, then we can't make more of these videos. When I say we're going to try our best, it's all on Cameron's shoulders. <laughs> If he screws this up, I don't know, man. It's his yeah. fault. Blame him in the comments. Dude, look how long this forest goes. Man, why dude, is it dude, half green and half dead, though? Yeah, yeah wait. Yo. Yeah. You actually, you actually pointed out something super weird. Yeah. That is weird. Bro. Yeah, it almost, see, it almost like seems that. like the, the green side was what it used to be, and then now it's, like, completely Damn, destroyed. Yeah. That's actually... Guys, that's actually so true. Like, yeah. can you look at it again? Yeah. Look. See how what? it's green? 
Yeah, it's green, all green on one side, and that... then the other side is dead. Yeah, oh, there's good. still a few couple oh my God. of green trees, but it yo, looks I just like, took it looks something like in. a plague no, is no, spreading. I just took something in. Yeah, like a plague. Yeah. Yo, guys, I just took something in. All the no trespassing signs seem to be on one side, the left side, which so happens to be the side where all the trees are dead. Oh. Is that not weird or what? That's mad weird. What the f***? <laughs> Jesus. That's crazy. Are you comfortable flying it right now? <laughs> I'm comfortable is, flying is, it, but I can't really see sh like through all these trees. I kind of want to go low. Yeah, that's why we need the Stromedy Squad to comment the timestamp if they do notice anything. Because, like, guys, check this out. Like, we're you, you guys already know the drill. We're yeah. watching it on this tiny little screen right now. Yo, how come you don't have the controls up? What do you mean? Oh, you just got used to it already, I guess? Yeah. <laughs> guys, take this in. We're above Clinton Road right now. And even more haunted than Clinton Road is like the forest that surrounds it. That's what makes this road so creepy is because it's a single road with no lights that runs through a freaking haunted forest, guys. Damn, I never knew this forest was so big, though. Like, it goes forever. But I if, know it, if it wasn't for all the dead trees, it would actually look pretty nice. Like, there's yeah. some shots where it's like, oh, that looks like beautiful, yeah. like British Columbia. But then the dead brings it over and then it's exactly. like... Exactly. Look how huge that lake is, dude. It actually that's is. That's massive. Dude, do you, do you think that's where they, like... Like, murderers would, like, dump bodies and stuff? Yeah. Because that's actually been a real thing, like, on Clinton Road. Like, people who, who kill people or kidnap, they come to Clinton Road to dump the bodies because it's what? so secluded. Like, nobody's going to find anything. Well, dude, look around you. Yeah, and during There's the literally winter, nothing here. Guys, I don't know. Let us know. Like, drop a like if you want us to try our best to take the drone out at night. Like, that would be insane. Like, imagine we saw, like, a, you know, imagine we saw, like, a little glow in the forest. Not and we, we went We're down and it was, that. like, a cult. We're not doing that. Dude, you know what you should do? Yo, I'm going to drive away right now. Yeah. Follow me with the drone. Right, okay? Yeah, yeah. Can you see me right now? Yeah. Okay, okay. Follow yeah, me. follow me, dude. Oh, my gosh. Okay. This is going to be sick. Wait, Yo, which way should I go? Left or right? Uh, I thought you were going left, but go right. Yeah. Okay, okay. All right, guys. Cameron is currently following us with the drone. I have the freaking thing up for you guys to see right now. How does it look? Looks good, but your car's zooming. I can't catch really? it. Really? Should I slow down? Yeah, slow down? Should I slow down? Okay, yeah, okay. Slow down a bit. Dude, make sure to keep an eye out on uh, the sidelines, like in the tree line beside us, especially to the left. Look how deep the forest is over there. Yeah, I know. It's... Holy crap. Are you still good? Whoa, dude, that literally looks epic right now. That looks sick. Guys, Cameron's following me on the drone on Clinton Road. Yo, I'm gonna take the car all the way over to the other side of Clinton Road and see if we can discover anything from in the air over there. Oh, dude, that literally looks epic right now. You still following me? Of course, man. Dude, that's freaking insane. Guys, it's actually crazy how fast the drone can go. All right, guys, so Cameron followed the car all the way to a new spot a few miles down the road. You guys know Clinton Road is absolutely huge and there's so many parts of it to discover. Ready? Yep. All right, guys, got the live feed up for you once again. All right, let's check out this area, dude. Dude, we gotta find something. I hope so. We 100% gotta find something. You if jinxed not, it when you said that. Yeah. We just came here. We're not gonna find anything. I thought yeah. you didn't want to find anything today. Damn, nice guys, we're actually. Day. What does it look like in this area? The let same, me see. bro. I swear it looks the let same. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, okay. It still has that divide, though, where it's like more green on one side. Yeah. Damn, it's actually dude. crazy. Wait, what's that white building over there? That's a great question. Guys. Oh my gosh. You I'm see that? Yeah, let's go check it out. Yeah, go over there. Yo, that must be one of the houses that have people that uh, go right to the lake for their water source because it's right beside the lake. Potentially. That can't or maybe be a it, house. it definitely has something to do with the the no trespassing signs. Dude, we gotta see something. Well, like, I got try to try to point what? Yo, back when it was all green and living in its former glory, that's when you would want to own the land. Now, if the even somebody wants to sell it because of all like the weird spiritual stuff, they can't. Yeah. No one wants to buy Clinton Road. Yeah, guys, like literally that's a fact. Like nobody wants to buy this land. And there's actually been multiple occasions of the person like we saw for sale signs here last time and nobody wants to buy this guys because it's super haunted it 30,000 acres yeah yo check out this like ravine area what's what? all that under the bridge yeah maybe see if there's anything under the the bridge all right let's do it remember last time in canada yeah guys we checked under a bridge and yeah, we saw somebody there. literally just sleeping under the bridge it was freaking weird dude what just randomly in the middle of nowhere which way should we go explore I don't know, bro. I'm kind of lost right now. Okay, let's check the bridge first, and then I say we go down the road a little bit more, and... And then maybe go more in the direction <coughs> of that white house. Then I yeah, can't. yeah, we should definitely go that way, too, and see what's on the other side of the lake. Oh, and guys, I didn't tell you about the phantom trucks that you're supposed to see on Clinton Road. But basically, guys, phantom trucks are, in like, ghostly trucks. Like, they don't really exist, but you can if you come here at 3 a.m., you're supposed to see 
literal phantom trucks and if you stand out in the middle of the road it's supposed to just go right through you not that you're supposed to do oh my that God, what but the fuck? yeah guys that's do not scary, like shit. ever go on a road or anything or put yourself in danger but apparently that's the myth like like it's transparent it can go through you that's like actually... you already shouldn't be going on roads at 3 a.m but definitely don't go to clinton road at 3 a.m yeah i don't want to if you can get under that bridge do you think we'll be able to keep the signal to do that wait does it even have a part that you can see underneath that's whoa that's like a cool thumbnail right there dude Is that whoa flaw of the camera yo what's that what yo it? dude that's a freaking ouija board what? No. That's a freaking Ouija board, dude. What, why does it look so small? Dead ass, that's a Ouija board. You didn't just see that. I kind of did. Guys, go play back the footage right now. There was a freaking Ouija board. No way. I swear it was. Ass? I swear. I, I almost can't tell. that It's too small on the screen. Guys, was that a freaking Ouija board? Like, let us know down below in the comments. Holy dude, what the shit. hell? That means somebody was here, like, at night playing the Ouija board, trying to get in contact with the, maybe the boy. The boy that throws the quarters up. Yo, and it oh, from the from the river. Yeah, it definitely yeah, works too. It definitely it definitely did get in contact with them because who would just leave a Ouija board at the scene, right? Yeah, why'd they leave it there? Oh, or maybe it was too haunted because Ouija boards are like yeah, they yeah, attach to you. Ouija Bro, remember what is this? Yeah. You see this? Yeah, looks like an old what is broken that? down building. Oh, or what something. the hell? Where'd you where'd you find that? I don't know. I was just moving it around the floor. Yo, there's been cult reported oh activity on Clinton Road. Do you think it has anything to do with that? Like where they perform rituals, dude. I don't know about you, but this is looking like some ritual stuff. Damn, this looks. Scary. This is actually looking like some ritual stuff. Like it look. It's why, like why is it? It's like, like the remainder of what used to be like a castle or something. You know what I mean, bro? And I think wait, is all this part of it, or is this just rocks? I can't I really know. tell. And notice how it's two colors. Dude, like that's just hundred percent man-made. Holy Clinton crap, Road. dude! I can't believe what we're finding on Clinton Road, You're dude. Getting... If we found this already, who knows what else we could find? Like if we go, this road goes for miles. We've explored like what? A few miles of it? Yeah. Find the outskirts. Dude, what the hell is that, though? I don't know, bro. Guys, we saw a freaking Ouija board, and now some, like, weird castle ritual cult-looking thing. This is getting weirder by the oh minute. Oh, my gosh, and they were right next to each other, too. Someone probably bought, brought the Ouija board over there to, to start their cult. Yeah. Right? Yeah, dude. Literally. Like, it doesn't look like a house. Like, what's that no big idea. thing in the middle? Dude, I don't know. Dude, it you see that? Like a, Wait, do you see that? Where? There's, like, a little movement behind the tree. You see that? Where, where, where? Right here. Oh shit, my bad. Where? Right behind this tree. Do you see it? I don't see it. Dude, I'm not seeing it. Right there, anything. right there, right oh, there. Oh, the black, the black figure. Where? The black figure, you see oh. that? Are you blind? <laughs> oh, it's a person. Yeah, it's like, oh. Is it a person? Right is it? Oh. Or is that an animal? Uh, no, it's a that's a, sure. yo, that's a person. An animal would be larger. Is it than actually? That. Yeah. yeah. Dude, what are they doing near this freaking castle looking thing? I don't know. Bro, they probably were the one building it. What the hell? Yo, try to get closer. Holy how shit. close can you get? Yo, I actually don't know how close I Fam, are those tires right there too? Dude, I don't I don't freaking know, man. Tires. Wait, is that am I tripping or is that a person, fam? Yo, if there's tires Dude, there, th that would actually make a lot of sense. Bro, I think if there's tires there. Potentially there was a car wreck. You know how there's always a car wreck at, at the dead man's uh, turn? Is that what it's called? The dead man's turn? Oh, yeah. yeah so what if there was a car Yo, wreck? That bro, makes what perfect car, sense. What if the car smashed into no. that building and that person's been stuck there? Like a curse has been put on them and they've been stuck there. And now kids Yo, come with the Ouija board. That's actually a theory. Fam, yeah. actually, there's literal tires though? Yeah, they're all over the place here too. But fam, Dude, what are you guys this guy? seeing this or am I the only one seeing this? Dude, fam? what's this guy doing? I don't know fam. And he's all in black and sh bro, this is actually scary as f Oh, I can't zoom on this, huh? Dude, what is this guy doing? I don't know, bro. It's so hard Dude, to Dude, he's like climbing the, the freaking building. He's climbing it? Nah, it looks like he's hiding. Or Yo, something. I'm, I'm, like, Yo, I actually can't he, believe this. He probably sees Yo, the how drum. do we always see this kind of stuff? I bet you he sees the drum. Should we, we're always should we be concerned places, right now? Like, yeah. is this weird or is this just normal yeah, for somebody there. to be there? Yo, he's running he's away running. now. He's running. Yo, he must have seen it, huh? He must have I don't seen know. the drone flying. Yeah, because it's really loud, too. So, like, how can you not? Yo, he's gone. He's gone. Where'd he go? All right, yo, Stormity Squad. Sorry for the abrupt end there. Guys, I had to end the clip because the drone's battery completely died and we weren't able to get any more footage. But basically, that guy in black just completely disappeared, guys. This was so freaking weird. One of the weirdest drone videos I have ever done, guys. And I know I say that every time, but literally things just keep getting weirder and weirder. But if you guys want us to go back to Clinton Road, potentially at night, let me know down below in the comments, guys. Drop a like and hit that freaking subscribe button. This was absolutely insane. 
there's so many more of these videos to come so stay freaking tuned stromedy squad i'm gonna finish editing this video for you guys and and it should be out on sunday february 16th stromedy squad i love you guys i will catch you in the next one and as always peace